Hello and welcome back to Skyrim. Clearing out a mine today, isn't that fun? Iron's a good stout metal, a fine thing for a Nord to dig. I think that's a really rare chance from iron. Here to dig, that's all. I think that's everything, Clem. Sorry, gotta run. You've come to Dawnstar at a strange time, friend. It seems everyone in the town. Right. Let's find this priest of Mara. troubles you, my son. The entire town is being plagued by horrible nightmares. They're in serious danger, but I'm afraid there's little I can do about it. What could you do? Uh... Hmm. These dreams are manifestations created by the Daedric Lord Vermina. She has an awful hunger for our memories. In return, she leaves behind nightmares. Not unlike a cough marks a serious illness. I must end her terrible influence over these people before the damage becomes permanent. I need to return to the source of the problem, to Nightcaller Temple. Perhaps you'd be willing to assist me in that regard. All right. I've already said too much. If anyone overhears what we're saying, it could start a panic. I would simply ask that you trust me and help me end Dawnstar's nightmares. Very well. Wonderful. My Lady Mara will be quite pleased. Nightcaller Temple is only a short walk from Dawnstar. Come, we must hurry. Vermina resides in a strange realm known as Quagmire, a nightmarish land where reality shifts upon itself in seemingly impossible ways. From her citadel at the center, she reaches forth to collect our memories, leaving nothing in return apart from visions of horror and despair. 
Who can say? Perhaps she collects them for display like works of art in a nonsensical art gallery. Whatever the case may be, her intentions are far from benevolent. I've promised to answer all of your questions. Follow me. Right. I tell you, I tell you, the dragon. Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Power of Wait, my son. Believe Do I have to dismiss Lydia first? Comes. It's an end to the yes, it looks like it. Oh no. He's on the move finally. I work for the Wind Peak Inn. You should head on inside. It feels good to finally have a chance to help these people. Helplessly watching them suffer has been difficult. Heard about you and your honeyed words. The tower on that hill is our destination. People around here call it the Tower of the Dawn. I'm not familiar with the tower's history. But it was deserted for quite a long time before Nightcaller Temple was established inside. When the temple was active, the priests would rarely be seen in Dawnstar. They preferred to live a solitary existence. The temple had been abandoned for decades now. Ironic, isn't it? A ruin within a ruin. Mm -hmm. There's a small shrine to Mara I established inside the tower's entry hall. I was hoping to seek spiritual guidance from her. Rafes. one out first I guess I think he's gonna make me dismiss Lydia once we get inside, which is a bit unfortunate. Before we enter, I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. Years ago, 
This temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. They were being plagued by nightmares, just like the people of Dawnstar. All right. Before we enter, I must warn you about the... Years ago, this temple... No. Knowing they could never defeat the orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma, putting everyone to sleep. I'm concerned that when this place is unsealed, the miasma will dissipate and they'll awaken, both orcs and priests alike. The miasma was created by the priests of Vermina for their rituals. It's a gas that places the affected in a deep sleep. Because the rituals would last for months or even years, the miasma was designed to slow down the aging process. Sadly, yes. The longer an individual is exposed to the miasma, the more the mind can become damaged. Those who've been under the effect of it for extended periods of time have been known to lose their minds entirely. In some cases, a few never awoke at all. Once we get inside, all will become clear. automatically dismisses. Is he going to do it? Oh, I guess I'll zone in and out. strange. I guess I can try shouting at him. Do your worst. There we are. Now I can show you the source of the nightmares. Over here. Ooh. Behold the skull of corruption. The source of Dawnstar's woe. We must reach the inner sanctum and destroy it. Come, there's no time to lose. All right. Ah! You ah! your 
Damn it! The priests must have activated this barrier when the miasma was released. Impossible, actually. I wonder. There may be a way to bypass the barrier, but I must check their library and confirm it can be done. I suppose there's no point in concealing the truth any longer. My knowledge of this temple comes from personal experience. I was a priest of Vermina. Hmm. When the orcs invaded the temple, I fled. I left my brothers and sisters here to die. I've spent the last few decades living in regret and seeking redemption for Mara. And by her benevolence, I will right my wrongs. I still have my key to the library. Whenever you're ready, let's move on. More holds that the skull of corruption holds a constant hunger for the memories of others. The skull has been out of touch for so long, I fear it's gained the ability to reach out on its own and try to feed. What it does with these memories is just conjecture, and an argument for scholars and historians to this very day. All right. We mustn't tell. The skull needs to be destroyed as soon as possible. Just up here. Be careful. We're certain to find more of the awakened within. Oh, already getting up. Scary. Oh, he went flying. Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Safe more regularly. We're certain to find more of the awakened within. At least I know where they are now. No. 
Burn the temple. You kill the priest. You are full of my No more. I yield. I yield. Time for your final rest. Well, I guess that's that. Barring any more interruptions, perhaps we can locate the information I need. We're looking for a book of alchemical recipes called the Dream Stride. The tome bears the likeness of Vermina on the cover. It should be here somewhere. Okay. You'll check the shelves around the balcony. I'll check on the lower level. Yes, my... What is it I can help with? Do, but I will. Um, actually, no, I can use this. Could only train one point of speech at the Khajiit, so it's not worth going out for that. I'll take that. That puts me up to... Three hundred and one. With the shield. I found the book. Yeah. Let me take a look. More will be praised. There is a way past the barrier to the inner sanctum. It involves a recipe for a liquid known as Vermina's Torpor. Yes, the Torpor grants an ability the priests of Vermina called the Dream Stride, using dreams to travel distances in the real world. Quite amazing, yes. Alchemy and the blessings of a divine distilled down into a ingestible liquid. Sadly, I have yet to see it function in person. Uh, as a sworn priest of Mara, the elixir won't work for me. The torpor will only work for priests of Vermina, or the unaffiliated. All believe there is a laboratory in the East Wing. If we proceed there, we should be able to locate a sample. All right. You'll be viewing the memory of another through your own eyes and with your own body. 
Those around you will perceive you as normal, and you will find the words you utter may not be your own. Thanks to all of these odd principles, there is quite a lot of debate as to whether this is really a dream or just the machinations of their mina. I will watch over you as you slumber to ensure your safety. If I deduce anything is amiss, I will use my arts to bring you back. Otherwise, I am uncertain what will end your dream stride. Perhaps when Vermina's curious appetite has been filled. The laboratory adjoins the library. I'm hoping to find a sample of the torpor left undamaged. Priest of very dangerous. similar to a potion. I'll begin searching up here. The torpor should be in a tall bottle with dark liquid. If you find it, bring it to me. Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Who would like the damage health things would be very useful.
Yes, my. I'm relieved you discovered a bottle intact. This place looks as though it was ransacked by the orcs. So, I've taken us this far, but you need to guard us the rest of the way. Drake. All right. Dawn Star's fate rests in that tiny bottle. The longer we wait, the more damage Vermina could be doing to those poor people. I understand your hesitation, but I promise you that it works. I'll save just in case. Cont the orcs have breached the inner sanctum, Brother Varen. We must hold. We can't allow the skull to fall into their hands. But no more than a handful of us remain, brother. Then we have no choice. The miasma must be released. The miasma? But, brother, we have no alternative. It's the will of Vermina. And what about you, Brother Casimir? Are you prepared to serve the will of Vermina? Then it's decided. Brother Casimir, you must activate the barrier and release the miasma. Let nothing stop you. Brother Thorin, we must remain here and guard this skull with our lives if necessary. I'll show you what the real Can't take the gem. No, now I can. Fortunate. It, it worked. Mara be praised. You vanished after drinking the torpor and materialized on the other side. I've never seen anything quite like it. How I envy you. I can only imagine the excitement of seeing history through the eyes of another. Sadly, I am resigned to just reading of its wonders through my research of the skull. Indeed. My reverence for Vermina's machinations should not take precedence over our mission. My apologies. The inner sanctum lies ahead. We must reach the skull and put an end to Dawnstar's troubles. Lead on, my friend. All right. Come. I should have more torches, yeah. We must get to the skull and destroy it. As well, take the opportunity.
do for now. So that one's dead. Okay, let's move on. What are you looking at? Time for your final rest. Ah! Never yeah. should have come here. Oh, 
way. Bear, Thoric, you're alive. No thanks to you, Casimir. I no longer use that name. I'm Miranda, priest of Mara. You're a traitor. You left us to die and then ran before the miasma took you. No, I, I, I was scared. I wasn't ready to sleep. Enough of your lies. I can't allow you to destroy the Skull, Priest of Mara. Then you leave me no choice. We fight to the last! Oh dear. Well, they're fighting each other for some reason. I guess they accidentally hit each other. I don't think I have any black soldiers, but oh well. Is it Mara's will to torment me so? We had no choice. Yes, you're right. If they needed to die so that Dawnstar could live, then it was worth the price. It's time. The skull must be destroyed. If you'll stand back, I'll perform the ritual granted to me by Lady Mara. First, All right. An incantation to remove the barrier. I call upon you, Lady Mara. The skull hungers. It yearns for memories and leaves nightmares in its wake. Grant me the power to break through this barrier and to send the skull to the depths of oblivion. He's deceiving you. When the ritual's complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. Quickly, kill him now. Kill him and claim the skull for your own. Vermina commands you. That's interesting. Oh, mead. Forgive me if I don't appear relieved. This temple has taken its toll on me. In time, I believe I will. I'd constructed a meager shrine tomorrow in the antechamber where we entered. My intention was to spend the rest of my years here, burying the past and praying for forgiveness. But instead, I wish to offer my services to you. If you ever wish to journey with me, I'll be here. Thanks. There's no need to thank me. What you did was for the people of Dawnstar. If anyone should be thanked, it should be you. Right, let's get out of here. Hopefully, never. Better. 
Hopefully Lydia is still outside. She should be. Anyway, I suppose I'll end it there for today. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.